Looks like the mailman has dropped off another Lego haul. Let's open this up and see what's inside. Some of you probably already can guess that it's more Lego. So let's open this up and see what kind of bricks are inside the package. Well, let me pull out the receipts real quick. Okay. So be sure to turn on notifications and subscribe to see more haul videos just like this or ready to open up. And there we go, right there. So let's see what kind of parts are inside this bag. Obviously you can tell I got a lot of oddball colors and shapes. Oh yeah, look at all that. Okay, well the first thing we can obviously see is this big rear of a plane, so this right here is a hint. Now in addition you can probably see as well I got plenty of slopes, preferably 3 by 3s I'm actually running low on these so I wanted to get some more. And cool yellow. So I got cool yellow in several sizes. I believe I have it in one by one. One by four, obviously. One by threes. And some one by twos. Lots of oddball colors. Well, found a meat cleaver. I needed that piece for something. Some finger wells. Of course, I got the cool blue or aqua blue and of course the teal anything else that's good oh here we go the printed popcorn brick so I got a bunch of these I don't know how many I got in there let's we'll see if I can find the receipts that I just chucked receipts are not really the most exciting part of the haul well let me count everything up and make sure that everything's in the order Everything is in my order, including a few extra pieces that LEGO had generously have given to me, which is really nice. So, in the top left, I do have some 1x1, one 1x2, one, one two, and 2x2 two two aqua blue flat tiles. I do have some sand green 1x1s one and 1x2s, one medium nougat 1x1 one one and 1x2s, one dark orange 1x1 one one and 1x2s, one and teal 1x1, one 1x2 one, one flat tiles. Now, I did get a few of these mud guards or fender wells. I'm getting into making more vehicles and I needed some red. And these are the low profile styles. So I'm glad that they had these in stock. In addition, I did get five of the printed one by one bricks with the popcorn design on the front. One meat cleaver. Yes, that was an impulse buy I had to get. I had to have that. And that is in flat silver. 10 of the 3x3 3 30-degree 3 slopes, as well as 10 of the 1x3 30-degree slopes. I'm working on a future tutorial, and I had found out I used most of them for the 1950s house, so I had to get a few more of these in this size. Now, if you can see right here, I got plenty cool yellow bricks. I did get 15 of the 1x1 and 1x2, as well as 20 of the 1x3 and... 25 of the 1x4 bricks. Now, is this going to be used for a boat or an airplane? I'll leave that up to your imagination, but that's what I got that for. I have this in red and blue, but I didn't have it in white. So there it is. I got that done. Now, some of you have heard about my demise with the Legal Ambassador Network, and yes, they flat out denied me. I would have to change a lot on this channel, including the removal of most of my tutorials and mocks, which I prefer not to do. So I'll make a special dedicated video just to kind of walk you through my experiences applying for the Legal Ambassador Network as well as reading their reply. As far as for future tutorials, I'm still working on a bunch of stuff. I've just been hammered with work, getting a lot of deadlines completed by the end of the month. So it's just a lot of stuff that I have to complete. Other than that, 
There's my large oddball colored hall.